So this past weekend was my high school's 10-year class reunion. Unfortunately, I wasn't able to make it due to being in Canada. So I obviously was not there. And because I wasn't there, I wanted to shoot a video that I thought it would be neat to have like a kayaking video where I was going and telling a little bit about what's happened in the last 10 years, catching people up on stuff. And that was my plan. Unfortunately, the few days before the reunion when I planned to do the video, the weather here just was awful. We had really, really big waves, lots and lots of wind, rain. It was just gross outside. And because of that, I was not able to shoot the video I wanted to shoot. I finally shot one like a day before the reunion. And the only place I could go to do it was this tiny cove that was like 40 minutes away and I had to go through like crazy waves to get there with like water getting in the cockpit of my kayak and everything and almost flipping many many times just to even get there to that sheltered area to shoot the video so you guys didn't get to see the video I wanted to shoot and where I wanted to shoot was here I wanted to do an early morning or a sunset video of here this is hole in the wall it is near where I live, not too, too far away. It took me, let's see, an hour and 15 minutes to get here. So, I don't know, a bit of a distance. It's not the closest place ever, but it's not the furthest place either. I guess I could have kayaked somewhere further away. But either way, it is definitely one of the most scenic places. Um, this is just this small little channel between two very, very, very big islands. And it is very narrow, and it has some really interesting rocks all around it. And at its smallest point, where it's the most narrow, it has these really, really neat cliffs. And these cliffs are great to drive by in boats. People go and um, when they take sightseeing tours that they pick up in town, they always go through here to show off Hole in the Wall because it's really neat. Some of the cruise ships barely make it through here. I think the Island Queen has like three feet on either side of it. So it's pretty dicey for the bigger boats. But for us in a kayak, it's absolutely perfect. And it's just really neat. Um, a lot of people come through here and um, they'll park their boats just in the center and swim over to the cliffs that you see over there on the left and they'll climb up the cliffs and jump right in the water. Um, it's pretty deep there. If you're jumping from like the highest point, you might possibly uh, hit bottom, but from what I hear, it's a sandy bottom. So it's okay, it's all good. Um, but yeah, it's a really neat area. Um, wish I could have shown this to everybody in my I'm not making it to the reunion video, but instead I'm going to post it on Island Girl Talk, so you guys can check it out there. Maybe I'll post it to the reunion group too, whatever. Um, but yeah, this is Hole in the Wall. It's pretty cool. Um, if you ever make it up to northern Ontario and out on Georgian Bay, it's definitely a place I would suggest going to, because like I said, it's pretty cool here. The only time it's not so cool is if the Island Queen's going through and you've run out of gas in this channel. That can kind of suck. I've known plenty of people who've had issues like that before, so it happens. But, you know, as long as that doesn't occur to you, you will think this is the most wonderful channel ever, pretty much. I'll take you in closer here so you can see a bit more of the rocks that the people jump off of. Sometimes you even see chains or you see ropes hanging off of some of the tree limbs that are going out into the water because people, instead of just jumping, they'll go and they'll swing out on one of those ropes or on one of those chains and then go and just go bam right into the water. So it's fun. Definitely one of my favorite places here on Georgian Bay. Didn't get any better than this. Hope 
everybody is having a lovely, lovely morning. As lovely as I am. Any morning where it's calm enough that I can get out here and I wake up early enough to do so is a good thing, I figure. So, hopefully you are having fun doing whatever you're doing this morning as well. And this video is probably already super long, probably going to take me absolutely forever to get it uploaded considering I borrow Wi-Fi from the mainland so the signal isn't too great. So um, I guess I'll be having a sign off here in a minute because of that. Hopefully I'll try to book it so you can see what's on the other side of the hole in the wall real quick. And then I will let you guys go. And whoops, we are out into some fairly big water again. Not way out in the bay, still in the sound, but bigger water for this side of the island. So yeah, that's about it. Thanks for coming around hole in the wall with me. Um, I'll see you later. Island Girls signing off.